So, given that vector f is 3i plus 6j plus 3k, find the unit vector in the direction of f. Okay. So the first thing you would need to find, uh, just to simplify your work, is you um, need to find the magnitude. So let's find the magnitude for vector f. So the magnitude is found by the square root of uh, the square of each of these components. So we have 3i squared plus 6j squared plus 3k squared. So what do we get? This gives us a 9 plus uh, 36 plus another 9. Remember, 3i squared is 9. i squared is 1, j squared is 1, k squared is 1. Okay, so from there now, uh, we're just supposed to add up everything. So if we add 9 and 9, we get 18. That 18, we add it to 36, we get 54. Meaning that the magnitude of this particular vector is the root of 54. Okay. So now, how do we find the unit vector in the direction of f? So to find the unit vector in the direction of f, I'll just call it f, and I'll put this cap like this. So this will be equal to vector f as it is divided by the magnitude of vector f. So this is what will give us a vector in the direction of vector f. So what do we get? Vector f is this vector that we have here, which is 3i plus 6j plus 3k. So all this is over the magnitude of f, which you found to be the root of 54. So now this magnitude will just divide by every component that we have here. So f, which is a new vector, which is in the direction of the original vector f, will be equal to 3 over the root of 54 i plus 6 over the root of 54 j plus 3 over the root of 54 k, like that. So this is the vector we're looking for, the vector in the uh, direction of f. And it's a unit vector since we still have the i, the j, and the k. So that's it, that's where we have it. Thank you very much.